Hi Gemini, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I appreciate your love and support. Today we are going to find out who is thinking heavily about you right now and why. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me who is thinking heavily about Gemini right now and why. This person could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, like you are, or um, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, strong Pisces here as well, strong Aries, can be any sign, okay, uh, Gemini. Four Swords, this is definitely thinking, um, they're thinking and praying and hoping for something here, okay. In the meantime, with the Page of Wands here, Emma first, this person is also spying on you or stalking you. Um, and also, we've got the High Priestess here, Emma first. Yeah, they're trying to find something out. It could be some information, okay? Because Page of Swords sometimes can indicate some sort of information. And High Priestess as well in reverse. Hmm. They're thinking about getting some information in regards to you, okay? Perhaps... I feel like either they could be curious or that they wonder. Ten of Wands here in reverse if you have already given up on them completely. Six of Cups in reverse. This may be someone that you think um, maybe you have bad experiences with this person, bad memories in regards to something. And something that may have been revealed. It could indicate that high persist in reverse. Um, or somebody being uh, playing mind games or being deceptive in some way, shape, or form. So we've got the Eight of Wands here in reverse. It feels like, Gemini, this is someone you no longer want to carry this this burden anymore with them ten of wands in my first yep maybe someone that you do not want to return anymore or that you do not want to reconcile anymore and this person is still wondering and thinking whether if there could be a chance or are you seriously really moving on really giving up on them okay five of cups is right here this to me indicates them feeling really sad they're very disappointed mulling over the past or whatever that may have transpired between two of you and we've got the king of pentacles here and the aries energy which is the fool in reverse hmm. yeah this person is definitely i think they are still they're still interested in you mm, they could also be thinking that maybe four swords here can indicate somebody mm, strategizing planning they could be planning to give you something here as well with the king of pentacles like present you with either a commitment or something of value here but they feel kind of stupid with the full him of first for whatever they did here in the past to to a point where you may have given up on this person gemini so full swords again praying thinking contemplating planning also spying on you with the page of swords here in my first they're praying that you would come back but they're not too positive about it they feel like maybe you are done but they really want to make sure though i feel like this could be the reason why they're thinking heavily about you right now if you still want them let's see more gemini yeah you may have like <laughs> you if i was swords in my verse this may be somebody you have given up on just do you want to play these games with this this person anymore or just don't want to be involved in any sorts of drama or it could be also um you finding out in regards to them okay them just being really deceptive in some way shape or form and also we've got the higher fund here see and also we've got the nine of pentacles and the seven of swords here this person is sneaking around behind your back, Gemini. They want to return to you five pentacles in reverse. This is someone most likely you were in a relationship with in the past. If not, it's someone you, you love or used to love, okay? It could be a friend, a best friend. It can be anybody, but most likely um, I, I think it's a romantic relationship because there are a lot of cups here, six of cups. Mm. 
four pentacles here is the one verse. You you've given up on this person, Gemini. And they think and think and fall so they can't stop thinking about you. And they're very sad as well, right? And the five pentacles in reverse, they wonder, see they're sneaking around wondering, five pentacles here, will you return to them? Um, again, they wonder if that could be if there could be a chance for them to return to you because they may have learned from their lessons here with the Hierophant. I see with the Nine of Pentacles here again, this person may be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, can be any sign, but I feel like um, they're thinking heavily about offering you something, yeah, something solid, some like it could be commitment, could be an apology, can be anything. This person is thinking about doing that, okay. This is why they're thinking heavily about you right now, but at the same time, they're hoping and praying that you still take them back, okay? If if they were to take actions towards you, it feels like they're planning. Okay, let's see more, Gemini. You also have an admirer <clears throat> thinking heavily about you as well page of cups here okay this person maybe i think either they're very young at heart or that they are young younger than you are okay but um generally uh gemini you have one person eight of pentacles yeah this person has been working on themselves i feel they would like to extend you an olive olive branch here with the uh, page of wands and also we've got the will of fortune here this person wants to have a second chance with you okay and for some of you, Gemini, if you are involved in a long-distance relationship, there could be someone. Also, I feel thinking heavily about you. This person lives very far away from you, but they've been just focusing on their work right now. But they're always thinking about you, yeah, in a very passionate way. That's just for some of you if you're involved in a long distance relationship. And we've got the Leo energy here and the Aquarian energy here with the star and the sun. Gemini. Um, this person is actually, I don't know whether if, if it's this person from uh, the long distance one or it's the other one, okay, from your past. But it could be both as well, okay. Um, but there's definitely one person here, Gemini, with the star and the sun here. This person thinks about you, thinks highly about you, okay? They may also be thinking that maybe you are right now out of their league, okay? Um, or that maybe you have already um, recovered. You, you have healed, recovered, and you're done. You're moving on and that you are happy right now without them. That's another thing that I'm getting here. Um, but this person definitely has feelings for you, right? Page of Cups, romantic feelings for you. They also think about how attractive you are, how happy you you made them, okay? And for some of you, if you're connected with the, uh, connected with their child, or it could be both. I don't know whether it's the other person has a child. That's just for some of you, okay? A lot of details here. Either that person has a child or, or that you may have a child with this person. They could also be thinking heavily about that child, okay? How is the child doing? Is the child happy or not? Seven of Wands is here. Yep, this may be somebody you're trying to protect yourself from, okay? Um, I feel like they've done something here in the past, right? Seven of Swords. Hmm. But the Two of Wands here, Six of Swords, this person is thinking heavily about you because they still haven't moved on yet. And they're contemplating here, Two of Wands, in regards to reaching out, sending you something here. They definitely want to heal this connection. They, again, I feel like they could be thinking heavily about the child children, if you do have a child children with this person. Okay, Gemini, this is your reading. Hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. First one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've ever done. Um, and they're all very recent with different questions, different topics. Check it out if you want to. Um, uh, I post your videos almost every single day. Gemini, if you'd like to be notified. 
every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. And also Gemini, I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Alright, take care Gemini. Bye.